part two, the city. So I think it's two no matter which way we go. There's only like one question mark on this side, so we're probably going to go up this way. <clears throat> hit some question marks. And go up and hit this boss, I think. So it's super tenic. we want. Defends, we do not want. See if you can draw out a panache. You cannot. That's fine. Everything is fine here. Can you? Ten five, so we need to play one block. So we can't play the bludgeon. But we'll save that for next turn, possibly. I'll ask you to draw a card anyway. Great. Might as well just pull out a perfect strike. Do, 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 do. There we go. No thanks. Remove a card from your deck. You can no longer remove cards at the merchant. So this will work. Is there a card we want to remove? I actually think it might be worth getting rid of this. Maybe just have two hypotheses. Apotheses, hypothesize. And just the two upgraded ones. I mean, in theory, getting rid of the two would be... Would be the best way to go, because as soon as I've used one, the other two are useless. So yeah, I definitely want to get rid of this one. Twin strike, wild strike. I think we gotta go at something strike. Which, those are the only two? So twin. A oh, while. Wow. I think twin strikes possibly better because it's gonna be. It's gonna be 12 damage anyway, because we start with one strength. So it's just a better version of wild strike. Yes, yes, no. Do we actually get rid of the perfect strike? I'm not sure. No, we'll keep it, we'll keep it. Ooh, double panache. And then this into this. So it's going to do half, so it's going to do 24 damage. I'm not sure if it rounds up or down. 24, so it rounds up, I think. For a second. So for four, nine, so we'll take one damage, that's fine. <clears throat> Block potion. Ooh, pump strike, there we go. 
There we go. So we're gonna have we're gonna want to have some block. We've got the apothesis in the pocket. I think this hand is actually fine. That's uh, 16, so we're going to add a little bit more. Maybe I should have fished for a panache. That nah, wasn't there anyway. So 21 again. So probably once again these two. Sixteen. That is, tw yeah, that's exactly twenty-one. And then we'll fish for a panache. No. Put that on top of the deck. Look, all these panaches are gonna come at once. There they are. Oh, there's another one. I don't need the block this turn. Although we're gonna draw anyway, aren't we? Tihi, silly me. Fuck yeah, boy. <laughs> mm, kind of want to keep Pummel for the draw. Uh, that's 13 so we can can do an attack four can I play four cards here I can play one two possibly let's fish for a panache dang we'll put shrug it off I think at the top Right, we're going to play a thing ahead again. So whatever we're going to put out, put in, we're going to draw. And then put something else back. I mean, a mezzo is, yeah. You, okay. Eighteen, so we're gonna play that. I can take a little bit of damage. Because we're gonna gain eight six health back at the end of the turn. So I reckon we can do this. Kinda do wanna play more cards now though. We're only gonna have one. So I think twin strike's pretty good. Ah, uh, actually. Seven. Yeah, actually let's let's do the block. My maths is correct, which it's not. So that'll do 16. Let's just, let's just do that. Just kill him. Oh, Inflame's actually really good. Uh, 
24. So that's enough. Well, I say enough. It's enough by quick math standards. Hmm. That's a lot of damage. So 47. So perfect strike can take this guy out. And then we can Panesh Shrug. So I think we'll do that. And we'll take a little bit of damage here, but it's not enough for me to really care, I don't think. play 3 to do 20. I think I need to pull out probably a shrug. So that's only doing 9, so I'm taking a little bit of damage. Which I think is, once again, that's not too bad. Question is, is it worth blocking here? Nah. I don't think so. So we got the te the secret technique. I think secret technique and perfect strikes what we need to keep. Although then we do take however much 12 damage. There's the hypothesis anyway. See the perfect strike. Kills him. Maybe we then pull out a shrug. What's that? 60? Just not enough. Probably just do that. Set him up for the next turn. Sick. Ooh. It's actually kind of useful. Don't need to heal. Could go around this way. I think that's probably the best way to go because don't need to visit the campsites for any reason. So we save one perfect strike. Let's save those two. Tell size. So we're gonna kill one definitely next turn. I think they do either six or nine damage. Six, so we're gonna get enough. So we may as well play this. Pummel, pummel, pummel's not enough. 
Ah, oh, we just pull out a perfect strike. 85 damage. Palm strike or perfect strike is what I meant. No, I can't because I'm losing I'm losing a bunch of health and also it reduces the amount of damage that perfect strike does. So that's like a double double bad deal. See if we can get another block. We can, so we'll put a. Uh, because I'm gonna be drawing it back again anyway. So I guess it doesn't matter what I actually put on there. So I think we do something like this, and then twenty-one. Yeah, and then we just get rid of this guy. So the pummel gets rid of him. Um, well, we've got two mana. Uh, 65. Which I probably should have Panesh. Not panached. Actually, let's do that now. It's apothesis now. Try and draw in a panache. Nah. Next turn, we want a pummer strike. Gotta try and draw out a. Let's make sure we got some left. I'm gonna try and draw out a perfect strike. Or. Or something that can draw a perfect strike out. Like a big old, big old blocky. Shrug it off, might have to do. I'm actually gonna. Oh, I've got these blocks. Can you not get out Panache for Secret Technique? Yeah, that's that's what I was saying. I should have done that before I used the Perfect Strike. Oh, Panache. No, sorry. Uh, Apothesis, you can. Secret Technique only gets skill cards. Panache is a power card. Then I think I've got a twin strike, one of these guys. So let's see, 11, 16. So that's 28. Nine times three is 27. Uh, I think I can take a little bit of damage. Smash. Here we go. Ooh, that's nice. That's all right, but not really that. That's necessary. Uh, 
21. Yeah, let's... Oh. Three perfect strikes out there and be, be able to do that without being able to use them. So a bit, a bit harsh. I got three more in there, but... Let's do this. Oh, man. Getting lots of strike choices. Alright, so perfect strike can flatten this guy. Let's keep it like this. Obviously should have played Panache first. I don't think I'll be able to play five cards this turn anyway. Let me do that. Pummel for 10. We're gonna gain eight anyway. Oh, I got secret, I got I got brain farts. Oh, dude. I may as well upgrade one of the perfect strikes. And this is like, oof. I ain't going to Sizzler, I'll tell you that much. Let's see. Oh, I don't need that. I think the defend is probably enough. Maybe we should just shrug it off. Yeah, we'll sh shrug off anyway. And then get out a perfect strike. Do these perfect strike pluses are getting pretty insane? Forty. <laughs> Alright, this deck's getting super hot. Nah. Can no longer obtain potions. So we got one floor left, and we've got a thing full of potions. A thing full of pretty decent potions, actually. Like, we didn't even have to use a potion in that in that boss fight. So I think this is probably the best one. Although, raise max HP by 5 is fairly strong. Because we've got to go through, like, uh, 16 more floors. So we've got to lose 16. So we're going to end with 30 health. But I think the way things are going, getting this and opening with two perfect strikes is like insane. <laughs> 